Get out your umbrella, cause it's gonna be rain and pain. Yeah, this thing right here, it's not just for keeping you dry. I'm sure you've seen it in movies all the time, right? From Kingsman, Spy Umbrella to the spinning sword umbrellas from Shadow. Heck, even Star Wars had its own lightsaber version of the umbrella. But NatPat, those are all made up, right? No, actually, it turns out that you don't need any upgrades to turn your everyday umbrella into a deadly weapon. It's actually really common. In Kung Fu, several disciplines incorporate umbrellas into their fighting styles. Two of the most well-known are the Dragon and Tiger Umbrella style by Grandmaster Ho Lap Tin and the Shaolin through Clouds umbrella style by Grandmaster Wong Q Kit. But it's not just Kung Fu masters that are getting the most out of these pretty parasols. In Victorian England, women were incorporating umbrellas into self-defense. Yeah, all those prim and proper Victorian ladies were not to be messed with. When they weren't sipping their high teas, they were learning the art of jujitsu, fencing, and how to bring a man to his knees using a parasol with the Victorian umbrella defense. This technique only gained in popularity and eventually made its way over to the US. So I guess Princess Peach truly had the right idea with her signature umbrella. She learned from the masters to always 